Hello there. How are you? I'd like to say adieu. 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 To you and you and you. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions. I'm Corbett. I'm Julie Andrews. You are not. I actually am. I transitioned. You are not. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon, follow us Twitter account. Subscribe oh, yeah, like Patreon. Button. Uh, and Johnny, who is the, uh, some famous Indian actors who started in TV shows? There's one. Shwastika. Yeah. Sure. Soap operas. Yeah, sure. Why not? Right. Anyways, uh, this is a video called 10 Famous Bollywood Actors Who uh, Started Their Careers on TV Shows or Serials. Okay. So I don't know how common it is in India because here it's very common. That, that's yeah. actually, for the longest time, just where you started. Uh, yeah. Either um, um, to soap operas, obviously, was very common back in the day. Back in the day. Not so much anymore. No. Um, but... Often you start as guest stars, or yeah, it was like the transition point. You'd start on TV and then you'd transition to film. Yeah, so like Tom Hanks started on Bosom Buddies. Robin Williams started on Mork and Mindy. They just you can go. It was that was the transition, especially in the seventies and the eighties. But I'm guessing since TV wasn't as big of a thing in India until more recently, uh, OTT platforms now. Yeah, uh, it's probably not as common. I bet. Yeah, that's a good question that I don't know the answer to, and Drani would know, but she would only know partially because she watched, she grew up watching American TV. Yeah, but this is uh, from a channel called Tried and Refused Productions. Uh, I like them a lot. There, uh, they do reviews and different kind of videos like these as so well. So these aren't just celebs who were on TV. These are celebs who got their starts. Yeah, on television. On television. Here we go. There are some extremely inspiring stories when it pertains to some individuals making it big in the Indian film industry. Discussing some Second actors Ghana? that seamlessly transition from television to the big screen, here is Tried and Refused Productions, with 10 famous Bollywood celebrities who started their careers on television serials or shows. Aditya Roy Kapoor Before Aditya Roy Kapoor charmed audiences in movies like Aashiqui 2 and Ye Jawani Hai Diwani, he actually was a very well-known <laughs> DJ on Channel V. My hair used to oh. be like that. He also on a plethora of shows on the TV channel, including song lists and interviewing celebrities. He was a VJ. He not even foreshadow he would work with in the near future. It was I and Buddha movements with no, 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 I no. can never get that to happen correctly. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. I'm also going to study now. Kathak. My guru has told me to. Raj Pal Yadav. The actor who is known huh. as one of the best comedians to make audiences <clears throat> laugh hysterically in theaters is Raj Pal Yadav. The man has made us chuckle in many movies including Hangama, Chup Chup Ke, Garam Masala and Mutse Shadi Karogi. The actor who is all set to appear in the 2017 film Jodhwa 2 actually made his acting debut on a television show on Dur Darshan called Mungeri Ke Bhai Norangi Lal. <laughs> Rachi Desai is an actress that has sadly faded away from the limelight, appearing mm, in not beautiful pictures films in the last two years, including Azhar and Rock On 2. But before the actress made a breakthrough role in Rock On and Once Upon a Time in Mumbai, she was a very well known face on Indian television. Before transitioning into the film industry, the actress appeared in the TV show Kasam Se. She was cast as Bani opposite TV actor Ram Kapoor. <laughs> This eye also appeared in the reality TV show Jalal the Club. A lot of the TV shows look like um Yami Gotham. An extremely underrated actress in our opinion, Yami Gotham has impressed audiences and critics in soap operas. Vicky Donor, Badlapur, and Kabul. <clears throat> the actress also started her acting career featuring in a number of television shows. She made her television debut with Chand Ke Paar Chalo, which was followed by Raj Kumar Aryan. Following this, she played her most notable role in Ye Pyar Na Hoga Kam, which aired in colors. The actress also appeared in the reality TV show Meethi Churi No. 1. And <laughs> Mama's transfer is a year-to-year. We have to do something with our family. 
Ayushman Khurana. Hey. Hey. has been one of the best years for Ayushman Khurana in terms of his acting career. With successful movies like Bareilly Ki Barfi and Shubh Mangal Saavdhan, the actor who made his Bollywood debut with Vicky Donor also started his career doing a number of jobs before impressing us on the big screen. He won the second season of the reality TV show Rodies at the early age of 20. <laughs> Rodies. He was a radio jockey at Big FM New Delhi. He also became a VJ for MTV for a short while, hosting <laughs> shows such as Pepsi, MTV, What's Up, The Voice of Youngistan. The actor also did his fair share of hosting reality TV shows, including India's Got Talent, Music Kama Mukabla, and Just Dance. <laughs> Vidya Balan. Oh. He was famous for taking up challenging and eccentric roles in Bollywood, more or less paving the way for women-centric movies in the 21st century. He also started her acting career on television before charming us all on the big screen. At the age of 16, she starred in the first season of Ekta Kapoor's sitcom Hampanj as Radhika, a Paraku teenager. Ab dukan ka khologe bolo? It's so simple. That's her? Following the success of the show, Vidya refused director Anurag Basu's offer to star in television soap operas as she wanted to concentrate on a film career. After many failures to release a dozen Malayalam films that she had signed for and production hassles with Tamil films as well, Vidya impressed everyone with her breakthrough role in the 2005 film Parinita. Sushant Singh Rajput. Ah, oh, R.I.P. is a capable and impressive performer in movies such as Kai Po Che, Detective Byom Kesh Bakshi, and M.S. Dhoni, The Untold Story. Started That's the only one we haven't seen, I think. Yeah. The actor made his acting debut by appearing in a television show called Kiss Desh Mein Hai Mera Dil in 2008. In June 2009, Sushant began starring in the hit TV show Pavitra Rishta as Manav Deshmukh, a very serious and mature character working as a mechanic to help support his family. <laughs> They all look like soap operas. Mm -hmm. The the the, the lighting, lighting and, yeah. The actor also appeared in two dance reality. He's TV so talented. Shows, it's so sad. Season two, Angelic Declaja season four. Our Madhavan. Oh, oh wow! This is great. I had no idea. To Mani Ratnam to be cast for the 1997 film Iruvar, but the director cited reasons of looking too young for the actor not to get cast. Madhavan went on to feature in Hindi television serials in leading roles in ZTV. I'm guessing Shah Rukh Khan's going to be one. While he gained further popularity portraying the character of Shekhar in Saya, he also went on to act as a ship's captain in Seahawks and worked as a television anchor in Tol Mol Ke Bol. <laughs> Shah Rukh Khan. Aha. Who will be number one? Was Salman or like hits in the 90s because of which he garnered a big B. Big B. But his first taste of acting was not on the big screen but in television serials. Khan's first starring role was in Lake Tundan's television series Dil Darya, which began shooting in 1988, but production delays led to the 1989 series 4G becoming his television debut instead, in which he played the leading role of Abhimanyu Rao. Babyface. <laughs> this led to further appearances in Aziz Mirza's television series Circus and Money Calls mini series Idiot. His journey to stardom is still one of the most inspiring. Before we discuss the last actor, here are some honorable mentions. <laughs> Must be somebody pretty big to beat Shah Rukh Khan. Right. That Irfan Khan. Oh, oh, shit. Hardships and Irfan Khan might have seen it all. The actor appeared in many television shows before his film career even kick-started. The actor was in the need of work so much that while appearing in small roles in movies, he was simultaneously appearing in television shows as well. Before he made his debut in... I want to see that television show. He appeared in TV show Shrikant in 1985 and Bharat Ek Khoj in 1988. Some of the many TV shows he appeared in while still pursuing an acting career in movies include Chanakya, Chandrakanta and Banegi Apni Baat. And if the Samrath has been given to the Samrath, then the Mahamantri will be able to reach the Vivaastha to the Vivaastha. And that was the list, guys. Nice. Write it down in the comments below if you have some video ideas. I had no idea about the majority of them. The one that's most surprising is the earphone. I wonder how many have actually, because I, I bet Nawaz was struggling for so long. A long time. I'm wondering if he was in TV shows yeah. and... Probably as bad guys, little small bit parts. 
But also, I feel like in India, it happens more than it does here, where like n- nobody would kind of get their big break uh, a little bit. I feel like it just happens all the time. Like somebody with no credits, like this was their first film. Yeah. And they just came onto the scene and took it over by storm. Not not that that was Nawaz's story. He obviously, I've read his book and he struggled. Yeah. Uh, and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, I did not know Irfan. No. I heard that Shah Rukh Khan did. Right. Uh, and, and Johnny, As did obviously Indrani. Indrani uh, knew that. But yeah, I know it. Vidya Balan. Yeah. How, I wonder. Yeah, you guys let us know. How common Ayushman is it? It is very. We both. Obviously, Rick was a famous child actor. Uh, yeah, I some of you don't. My know. first job <laughs> was television. <laughs> yeah. He was on uh, Little House I, on the Prairie. I, no. I, but funny, I just got two checks. I got a $10 and a $4 check. For Little House on the Prairie. Oh, really? Yeah, I still get residuals for Little House. Um, I get, I, I make like twenty dollars a year off of Little House residuals. Oh, wow! Oh, it's amazing. Damn. Yeah, make it the big box. I'm rolling in it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like so normally if you're just a nobody actor here, you can get like somebody like a nobody actor uh, get, getting a guest star on a yeah, TV show. You are more big. likely yeah to, to get, get TV roles than you are film roles. It's still hard to get. Regular TV roles. Oh yeah, that is extremely difficult. Still, um, no, but if, like, you, if you get a guest star on a series, you're usually loving life. casting directors will want and producers because it's all about eyeballs. They're like, how known is this person? Correct. That is the most important thing, even over talent. Sadly, a lot of times is like, obviously. Oh, so they've done ten guest stars right on on many different popular shows right. So I think we can trust them. With this small, regular, reoccurring role. Correct. Um, and if it does well, we'll see how it goes. Yes, even a show, for example, when they cast The Office, they wanted unknowns. Which I wish they did more of. Unknowns. But that didn't mean they wanted inexperienced. So yeah. everybody that was there had credits and had already been up for shows, had landed pilots that were canceled. So these weren't That's green why people at all. It's, ve- it's a very famous audition Real on YouTube, you can look it up. Like Seth Rogen auditioned for The Office yeah. as Michael, um, and like like all these extremely famous people now. Same thing with SNL auditions, but weren't f- as famous then. Yep, uh, auditioned for for The Office. Yeah, and so it'd be really interesting to know how many. I bet Pankaj did. Would not surprise me at all. Or did they start in theater and then maybe they? Bye. Maybe like I was just thinking about that in terms of. But I get. I bet people in India, the casting people, and do not give two craps about theater, on your resume. For TV, yeah. Oh, you know, no. I'm sure they don't give a here. Crap. Then they unless it's Broadway, they really don't care at all either. No. <laughs> like, what matters actually? What matters? Um, in fi- it matters in film if you have theater training. Mm-hmm. So like I know the reason Austin got Elvis, was because Baz saw him on Broadway. In a two-person show with Denzel. Hmm. And when he auditioned him, he gave him not a, a piece of script from Elvis. He gave him a clip, a piece, some sides from a Tennessee Williams play. Because he wanted to know that the person taking on this role could act. Yeah. And so, obviously, but, but for TV, yeah, no. No. Now, especially sitcoms. Uh, that was really interesting. Fantastic video. Very. Um, please let us know any of that information that we asked for, any other in, uh, videos from uh, Tired and Refused Productions that we can react to that you think we would find interesting. Yeah. And uh, if you need any white people for your TV shows, let us know. 